so just got home. Well, got home like maybe four hours ago. Finally relaxed and zen. I got a package from, I cannot remember to save my life, from Fashion Nova. I always order from Pretty Little Things normally, but decided to do something a little different. I don't want you guys to see anything, but it's this giant box I have down here. If you want to just go through it, let's just look what's inside the box. I don't know where my box cutter is, so we're going to just use these. Dang. I didn't realize I ordered like this thick of stuff. I ordered some jackets. I honestly forgot half the things I ordered, so it's gonna be interesting looking through this. And I thought I had no clothes to go to California, and I've definitely got some good stuff. I just need, I think, one dress. And I don't think I have anything on my rack that I would like to wear. Look how shoes. I got more than one pair of shoes. I forgot. We got looks. We have looks. So these are some of the shoes I got from the Fashion Nova haul. So these green chunky blocked heels, they almost kind of give you like Christmas vibes. They wrap around your ankles. They're very, very long length. And then I also got these brown, brown kind of square toed heels as well. And they wrap around, I feel like it's a trend right now, the square toed giving you Balenciaga vibes, both of them. But yeah, those are both the shoes I got. All these other shoes on my shelf are from other places. If you want a shoe collection, let me know. Because I definitely have shoes for days. The lighting in here is not so great, but you'd definitely be able to tell. And sneakers on a different level. If you've made it this far in the video, definitely subscribe, leave a comment down below. Let me know what your favorite kind of shoes are, actually. How about that? Let me know what your favorite kind of shoes to wear are. Thanks so much for watching this far. And then I guess just continue the video. I'm at the mall trying to grab a couple of things for my trip.
I need face wash, maybe some tops. That's it. Nothing else. I can't leave this wall with anything else. Currently, I'll see you guys in the store. water heater it's located in that room over there so yeah that's what that noise is in the background but I wanted to quickly show you guys what I got I almost forgot half the things I bought but I bought some like really plain simple black shorts from forever 21 they're like the jogger sweat kind of sweat pan kind of situation it was $17.99. You would style this with a black bodysuit, maybe a one shouldered piece, something, some sneakers. Keep it very simple. Of course, from Sephora, I got my normal face wash. This is one that I like to use. I am addicted to this. It's amazing. This is the Drunk Elephant. I don't know how to pronounce this, but number nine, get the number nine. This is the cantaloupe glycerin. I don't know what it is about this, but it just makes my face feel not stripped and dry, but just clean, just clean and fresh and ready for all the rest of the products I'm, I'm about to put back into my face. So I'm definitely a fan of this. Let's see if I can open this with one hand. Yeah. So, this is what it looks like when you open it. So, it's in like a little squeezy tube. It's actually a pretty good size. Like, if you look at it compared to the size of my hand. It's a good size. I think the last bottle I had lasted me like four months. Or, I'm going to say like three or four months, which is not horrible but love this also from sephora i got this which i actually saw was new in the store i honestly kind of excited about it and see the shadow of my ring light if you guys knew how i propped up my ring light you guys would laugh it's in between some of my plants so yeah this is the drunk elephant face value comes in a box they had i think maybe two other ones but they were all named different things so you definitely have to go look online and this is definitely not sponsored you know you see you see where i'm at right now but yeah i just really like their stuff so i wanted to try out something new and this one is the brightening routine it comes with c firma fresh proteiny their b hydra and their c tango I mainly got this because it's the only one in stores that comes with the full-sized C Firma, and I love, I love this. I think they remix the formula where you kind of have to blend the two. It lasts longer. It has a longer shelf life, um, which is great for our products because how many of us have products in our bathrooms and on our shelves that we have to throw away or we haven't touched for years and we're like damn now i want to use it but it's expired or it's gross and thick and ew so it comes with so this is the only full size in here then it comes with some mini products i don't want to break a nail but i'm getting my nails done tomorrow so that's the plan for the rest of you see they're gross underneath don't look I wish I could post this so I can ask you guys what you think, what kind of nails I should get next, but 
this is hard hold on it's not working but it just opens up like this i love the colors in here they have the best colors it's up like that so this is cute i like that it's an african-american woman or honestly could be any one of color but um i do like her little fro her curls flower earrings the necklace this is cute comes with a little card shake things up so it tells me how to mix the product which is i guess i'll try that in the morning or maybe today since i'm going to be using it it comes with it. this is so cute and it's reusable it's nice metal opens up like that that's cute i like that it's not too much packaging not too much like of course this has to be thrown away but I can keep the rest of this and i can keep actually the rest of my face products in here and travel with which i'm happy about so this is the full size c Burma with the liquid serum base eye cream it's not that i don't like it i think it's actually a really nice consistency i used it on my last one that i had but the only issue i don't use eye cream very much honestly i like to just use what products i use in my face and try to get it as close underneath my eyes without getting it in my eyes as possible. So, but I, I think I need to work on it. So don't take after me. I'm not an esthetician at all. Yeah, I'm just sitting on the floor. Yeah, I guess that is that. So this is the C Firma. You pop it open, you pop it open by just like pushing this backwards. I like pushing the whole top away from the bottle. So just kind of cracking it open. The powder comes out like that. Screw this off. Give that a little, also unscrew that as well. And then basically the goal is to put that into this. You take this and Nice and tight. We're going to give it a shake. Maybe give it a little soap bottle maneuver. It preferably the front of the bottle is this. And then just pop it back into place. And then all this does is this screws up for you to pump. There's no lid you have to take off. And then it screws back down to go away. And then I'm just going to put this in there with that. And that's going to be my travel. Honestly, this is like a travel daytime kit. That would complete my travel face care. I wouldn't have to take anything else. This in itself is heavy. It's going to go in the carry-on. That's like perfect. It's so cute. I also got this. It's a little travel size Gucci bloom. It just smells so good, so grown and fruity at the same time. I love the bottle. The bottle is just a really cute color. Looks like that, which is nice because you don't end up losing your top. And it's a little roll on. I wish you guys can smell it. It smells so fucking good. I think I'm going to get the full size. This was me just trying this out. I haven't even really used it yet, but in the store and at home here. And I think this is like one of my favorite perfumes that I own. And I have quite a collection, but love that. But of course, I needed some more setting spray. So I got the Urban Decay All Nighter. I wanted to try the Charlotte Tilbury, but apparently a lot of people like to buy it. So yeah. Going back to Forever 21, because everything is purchasing of bags now, so I just threw everything in the Sephora bag to save the trees and to save money. But I got some sheer pattern tights because I think this will look really good with the leather skirt that I showed you guys. I want to wear these. Yeah. I got this gray under, like it's almost like a beater or a tank. If you want to call it that 
I don't know how to describe it. It's just a plain tank. I want to wear underneath the set that I also got from Fashion Nova because it's missing an undershirt, which I still need to tell them about because in the picture it had an undershirt, but maybe I should read the description because I got two pieces out of the three and I think they're supposed to be three. So I want to wear this underneath there for now because I leave literally in the next 48 hours. So I don't have time to order anything anymore, sadly. And this is why I always try to order things two weeks in advance to try to get myself prepared for a trip, but uh, that didn't go as, as planned. So I went to Zara also today. I think you guys saw me walking through Zara. I got this hat. Honestly, it's a little overpriced for a beret, but I'm gonna wear the hell out of this beret. We'll see, I guess most hats cost about that much. Like if you get like a snapback or a baseball cap, so. Yeah, sorry if I'm making you guys dizzy, but it's cute. It's a nice, warm, tan, brown color. It would look good with some boots, giving me very Perry vibes. So that might also look good with the skirt. I have like an idea, an idea in my head, or like some jeans and like, depending on what the weather is, depending. I got some jewelry because I've been needing some, some layering pieces. So I got honestly just things that I can layer. Everything is under, I think, $10. Not everything together, but each piece. So just some regular gold chain. I don't recommend wearing these in the shower or wearing them too long. They do fade. Easy pieces. You keep them for maybe six months, a year. Honestly, my jewelry kind of lasts me more than two years. And then I usually get rid of it. But for $10, that's definitely worth it. Just simple pieces you can layer up. And then I decided to get these. They're just pretty and I think they'll look nice layered and stacked with these chains. Like I think it'll be cute. Even if I just wear it with a t-shirt, I, I think it just looks expensive. I also just finished taking a shower, so there's that. Yeah, this is still my box of Fashion Nova stuff. You know, my life. It's the way my life is set up right now. Yeah, I'm going to go eat something. I may not even add this clip because it looks grainy as shit. Yeah, it's not. It's just dark. So currently looking a little tired um the plan is to number one take out my hair wash my hair do my hair also to unpack my stuff from the weekend that i thought i was gonna unpack during the week but didn't happen um and repack the suitcase to benefit this weekend <laughs> so that's the goal oh i got my nails done by the way it looks not as great down here Feel like in the sun it'll look better so at least got that done you guys saw me go to the store I'm currently taking out my hair right now <sighs> i'm tired i still have to do my hair and back i just need to take care of this <laughs> and life will be okay so i don't know if i'm gonna see you guys again tonight if i do it'll probably be like more like a check-in if not i'll see you guys in the morning when i look like a badass Probably still wearing a hair scarf, but other than that, I'm gonna be that bitch before I go to the airport. Also, take care of my skin tonight because I've been breaking out on my forehead and I don't like it. All right, I'm talking too much. I have to go do things. Bye.